your English practice teacher. How are you today? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking. What time is it? It's 7 a.m. Time to get ready for work. Where are my glasses? On the kitchen counter, next to your coffee mug. Did you make coffee already? Yes, I brewed a pot a few minutes ago. Can I have a cup? Of course. Help yourself. Who called me earlier? It was your boss, Mr. Thompson. Why did he call? He wanted to remind you about the meeting at 10 a.m. Do you know where my laptop is? It's in the living room, on the couch. Is it charged? I believe so. You plugged it in last night. When does the bus arrive? In about 15 minutes. We should hurry. Should I wear the blue or white shirt? The blue one looks great on you. Are you coming to the meeting too? Yes, I'll be presenting the new project. Have you seen my presentation pointer? I think it's in the top drawer of your desk. Will there be many people at the meeting? Around 20, including some department heads. What should we have for lunch? How about that new Italian place downtown? How much does it cost? Roughly $15 per person. Whose turn is it to pay? It's mine, don't worry about it. Why are you being so generous today? Just in a good mood. Did we get any mail today? Yes, a few bills and a postcard from Jane. What did Jane say? She's having a great time in Spain and sends her love. When will she be back? In about two weeks. Where should we meet her? Let's pick her up at the airport. Do you want to cook dinner or order takeout? I feel like cooking. How about homemade lasagna? Can I help with anything? Yes, please chop some vegetables for the salad. Are we out of olive oil? I think so. Can you grab some while you're out? How many eggs do we have left? Only two. We might need to buy more. What time is the movie tonight? It starts at 8 p.m. Should we invite Mike and Lisa? That sounds like a good idea. Where did I put my phone? It's on the dining table. Is it going to rain tomorrow? The forecast says it's likely. Did you feed the cat? Yes, she's had her breakfast already. Who was that at the door earlier? It was our neighbor, Mrs. Adams. What did she want? She brought over some muffins she baked. How kind of her. Should we send her a thank you note? 
Definitely, she'll appreciate that. When is your dentist appointment? Tomorrow at 3 p.m. Can you pick up some groceries after that? Sure, just give me a list. Where did you keep the umbrella? It's by the coat rack. Do you think I need a haircut? Maybe just a trim. It looks good though. How was your day at work? Busy, but productive. Are we out of milk? Yes. Could you add it to the grocery list? What was that noise? I think it was just the wind. Who is joining us for the weekend barbecue? Your sister and her family, and a few of our friends. When should we start preparing? Maybe around noon. Why don't you take a day off tomorrow? That's a good idea. I'll see if I can. Have you seen the TV remote? It's under the couch cushion. Is the book club meeting next week? Yes, on Wednesday. What are we reading this month? To Kill a Mockingbird. Did you finish it yet? Almost. I have a few chapters left. Should we visit Grandma this weekend? Absolutely. She'd love that. How long is the drive to her place? About two hours. Do you know if the bakery is open on Sundays? I think it closes at 2 p.m. Where did you get those lovely flowers? From the farmer's market. Who gave you that necklace? It was a gift from my mother. Why are you smiling like that? I just remembered a funny joke. Can you share it with me? Of course, but it's a bit silly. Is there any dessert left from last night? Yes, some chocolate cake in the fridge. What time is your yoga class? It's at 6 p.m. How do you feel after those sessions? Refreshed and relaxed. Are we meeting Tom and Nancy for brunch? Yes, tomorrow at Café Loon. Did you charge the camera? I did. It's ready for our trip. Who do you think will win the game tonight? I'm rooting for the Tigers, but it's going to be close. Where did you put the tickets for the concert? In the top drawer, inside an envelope. What time should we leave the house? Around 6.30 p.m. to beat the traffic. How often do you water the plants? Every other day. Do you remember the name of that Italian restaurant we went to last month? Yes, it's La Dolce Vita. Why don't you wear that blue dress more often? It's a bit too fancy for everyday wear. Have you called the plumber about the leak? Not yet, but I'll do it first thing tomorrow. Is it okay if I borrow your headphones? Sure, just return them when you're done. 
What was the name of that movie we watched last week? Whispers in the Wind. When is your brother's birthday? It's on the 25th of this month. Can we host the Thanksgiving dinner this year? I'd love that. Let's start planning. Where did I keep my reading glasses? On the bookshelf, next to the lamp. How was the play at the theater? Absolutely captivating. You should see it. Who is your favorite author? I've always loved Jane Austen. Did you send out the invitations for the party? Yes, and most of them have RSVP'd. What should I bring to the potluck? Maybe your famous apple pie? Are the kids asleep? Yes, they went to bed an hour ago. How do you manage to keep the house so tidy? Just a little bit of cleaning every day. Why are you up so late? I was finishing a book. Do you think we need a new coffee machine? Perhaps. The old one has seen better days. When did you last see my car keys? On the kitchen island. Who was that song by? It's by the Lumineers. Is it going to be sunny tomorrow? The forecast says it will be partly cloudy. What time does the store close? At 9 p.m. How do you like your coffee? Just a dash of milk, no sugar. Why is there a cat in our garden? It might be Mrs. Parker's from next door. Did you set the alarm? Yes, for 7 a.m. Where are we vacationing this summer? I was thinking the French Riviera. Can you help me with this puzzle? Of course, let's see. How many guests are we expecting for dinner? About twelve, including us. What are the main dishes? Grilled chicken and vegetarian lasagna. Who is bringing dessert? Emma said she'd bake a cake. When will she arrive? Around 7.30 p.m. Is the ice cream in the freezer? Yes, next to the frozen berries. Did you turn off the oven? I did, right after taking out the bread. How long is the drive to the beach? Roughly 45 minutes. Why are you looking so thoughtful? Just daydreaming about our next adventure. Can I choose the movie for tonight? Of course. Your choice. Who was that lovely couple at the park? That's Jake and Lydia, our new neighbors. What a day, isn't it? Indeed, filled with simple joys and memories.